is brought to you by Full Metal Jousting on History. Sundays at 10, 9 Central. The champion, two years older than the challenger. Henderson, three inches taller, but Edgar will have a two-inch reach advantage. Once again with the introductions, Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. Presented by Bud Light, here we go. Our three judges scoring this contest at Octagon side are Sally Amato, Howard Hughes, and Chris Lee. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the Octagon, Mark Goddard. And now, live from the sold out Saitama Super Arena in Tokyo, Japan. It's time! Five rounds for the undisputed UFC Lightweight Championship of the World. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a wrestler holding a professional record, 15 wins, two losses. He stands five feet, nine inches tall, weighing in at 154 pounds, 69.9 kilos. Fighting out of Glendale, Arizona, USA. Ladies and gentlemen, he is the former WEC lightweight champion. Introducing the challenger, Benson Smooth Henderson. And now, introducing the champion, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a freestyle fighter, holding a professional record, 14 wins, one loss, one draw. He stands five feet, six inches tall, weighing in at 154 pounds, 69.9 kilos. Fighting out of Tom's River, New Jersey, USA. Ladies and gentlemen, presenting the reigning, defending, undisputed UFC lightweight champion of the world. Frankie, the answer, Edgar! Okay, gentlemen, you understand the rules you're fighting under. You listen to me at all times, you keep yourself protected at all times. When I say stop, you stop. Touch gloves, let's do this. Frankie Edgar. Benson Henderson for the UFC lightweight championship of the world. Our main event as the Octagon has returned to Japan for the first time since 2000. Okay, guys, here we go. Lightweight world title. Ready? Ready? Let's do this. Tonight's clock brought to you by Safe, starring Jason Statham in theaters April 27th. Henderson the Southpaw in the white trunks. Frankie Edgar in the black trunks. Frankie has outstanding boxing, great movement. There's a nice inside leg kick to start things off by Frankie. Henderson striking very powerful, and he loves to throw leg kicks. That one got caught, though. Oh! That was crazy. How good was that attempt? Wow! <laughs> the movement of Edgar has been the key to him becoming a champion. I mean, I remember that night in Abu Dhabi, Joe, like it was yesterday, when he shocked the world, defeating BJ Penn to become the lightweight champion. And then he did it again. I'll tell you what, Mike, they look like they're at least one weight class away from each other. Big power kick by Henderson. And Frankie Again. caught the second one. Nice takedown by Frankie. Right back up is Henderson. I mean, you might be looking at a future welterweight against a future featherweight in this matchup. Yeah, you're not kidding. You know, I don't think Benson has any problem making lightweight. So I think he'll, he'll probably stay here, but Frankie easily. And I would love to see him challenge Jose Aldo for the featherweight <laughs> title. And I don't think he'd even have a problem making the weight. Jose might come up to meet him. 
I would love to see that as well. The latest issue of UFC Magazine offers an in-depth interview with UFC President Dana White. Plus, get into the heads of the Ultimate Fighter coaches for this coming season, Dominic Cruz and Uriah Faber. UFC Magazine on newsstands and now available by subscription. Superman punch followed by a right kick. Low kick. That one that went caught low. Frankie. Frankie shakes it off and right back at it. I'll tell you what, Frankie never stops giving angles, Mike. Never stands right in front of a guy, constantly moving. Benson looking for that big kick. That's he takes third, it again. You know what? That's the third time he's kicked with, with both legs. One's the right. A couple times left, that's the third time that Frankie Edgar has caught his kick. Well, you know, he's been working with Phil Nurse. Phil Nurse, an excellent Muay Thai coach, and that, that is a big Muay Thai technique, catching the kick and landing a punch. And I guarantee you they've studied Ben Henderson's game, which is very kick-heavy. You know, Ben comes from a Taekwondo background. He has outstanding kicks like we saw when Frankie caught that leg and he kicked with the other leg. Three kicks. Oh, there, there's a fourth kick thrown by Henderson that was caught again. But he's landing them before Frankie catches them, and they have impact. And there's a lot of power behind them. And that knee a moment ago did as well, Joe. Fight scheduled for five five-minute rounds. Nobody has beaten Edgar by knockout. No one has outpointed him with strikes. Henderson is 15 and 2 in his career. Edgar is 14, 1 and 1. And both of those ones are the great main. Yeah. Ever changing angles, darting in and out. Oh, he got caught there. Good left hand there by Benson. The champion Frankie Edgar. Again. Again. Amazing. Amazing. And he gets a takedown. Back up to his feet. Henderson goes for a standing Kimura. Henderson oh, again with the kick. Good power left kick. Henderson oh, nice follows knee it by up Henderson. with a knee. Under a minute remains here in round number one. Henderson seems to be finding his groove here a bit, Mike. Ben was way out of the way of that spinning back fist. Henderson, so driven, such a unique personality, and a will to win. You know, I'll tell you what, Mike, if, if, if Frankie keeps grabbing for kicks, one of the things that Henderson may do from that Taekwondo background is fake low and then come high. You know, that is, that is one of the core techniques of Taekwondo. The fake low kick, high kick. I guarantee you Henderson has that in his arsenal. Frankie, three. Don't, don't get comfortable in front. Keep your legs. Look at him. Be on his movement. Don't start getting in front. You understand? Him? Keep changing every move. Control him. H L S. Eyes. Pull over. Hit off the movement. His feet aren't good. Change your angle. Come in. Watch that knee. He's trying to throw things and off. Frankie, listen. Off when your, you catch your one, okay? So one back and come in one. When you two catch again. that kick, Frankie, you push don't him back. get this. Spin Keep him. scoring. Spin Keep him scoring, Frankie. We gotta kick his legs a little bit more. Stop those spinning stuffs. Get Frankie. Good right hand. Let's keep doing the same thing, just a tad more aggressive. You hear me? Look at me, son. Yes, sir, All right. Hey, he can't take you down on a thing like you know. No, no, no fucking way. He can't take you down. Crouch, the head trainer for Benson Henderson, who trains out of the lab in Glendale, Arizona. Got Fran Escudero actually dropped down 165 pounds to emulate Frankie Edgar during their training camp to help help him out. Former Ultimate Fighter winner who has made his return to the UFC. Longtime training partner of Henderson. Frankie has uh, quite a welt on that left eye. Mike. Yeah. And that could uh, prove to be a problem later. And, and you talk, lands a right hand on it. Sorry, Joe, you talked about the Taekwondo background of Benson Henderson. Both he and his brother, Julius, our black belts in Taekwondo, they started training Taekwondo in about fourth grade. And there's that kick again, he caught it, man. 
like to see him catch the kick and follow up with that straight punch counter. That's the vicious counter to catching the kick. You either take him down or return a straight punch. A minute into the second round. Championship fight scheduled for five five-minute rounds. Both men have gone the championship distance in their careers. Nice inside leg kick. Henderson just has a swagger to him. Again, he catches it. Man, this is crazy. Can you remember a fight when a guy caught more leg kicks? Not, not, not this many in a row. I mean, of the kicks that he has thrown, all but maybe one or two have been caught by Frankie Edgar. That was another nice inside leg kick by Frankie. And he caught a jab there by Henderson. I mean, Henderson's thrown about 10 kicks. He's probably had eight. Nice knee by Henderson caught. there in the clinch. Frankie is moving so well. You know, it's so hard to emulate that footwork. A limited quantity of collectible UFC Japan official programs are signed by UFC President Dana White and only available at UFCstore.com. Now, not connected. And yeah, then the knee connected, yeah. Yeah, he opened his mouth after that one. Good combination there by Frankie. Oh, spinning back fist miss. Explosiveness of Henderson displayed a moment ago. Check that one. Can't hit what you can't catch. Nice left hook by Edgar. That eye is really swelling, Mike. That left eye. We're early in the fight. Frankie's on top. Guillotine attempt. Front choke. He may try to make his way to the back because Henderson is not blocking it. Henderson has had a habit in his career of getting in bad, bad positions, nearly being submitted, and working his way out. And Henderson again went for that standing Kimura, and Frankie pulled out of it. Head kick. That time he was put in no danger. 90 seconds on the clock here in the second. Counter right by the champion. Henderson is targeting that swollen left eye with his jab. Nice leg kick by Frankie. What a matchup for our main event. Such a skillful matchup. You know, I mean, the tactics, the techniques here. Oh. I mean, there's a reason why the WEC kept the lightweight division. Yeah. And this is why. Good Anthony combination Pace are here Henderson. tonight with the highlight reel knockout. Yeah, how spectacular was that? And you talk about the Taekwondo there, right, Joe? Exactly. That was a Both perfect guys. example, and we saw it earlier tonight. Nice takedown. In the full guard here. Round and pound here by the champion. Big points being scored here late in round two by Edgar. Benson throwing his legs up, looking for a submission.